guess it would be fun to be Cinderella. Oh, I want to be Cinderella too. Yeah. <laughs> we can't all be Cinderella. <laughs> then how do we decide? Well, it's simple. This was my idea. I'm driving. I'm Cinderella. You bitches got a problem with that? We could stop the car right now. It's our pleasure. <laughs> I'm Dr. Fowler, and I'm a neuroscientist. And I'm Dr. Rostenkowski Wallowitz, and I'm a microbiologist. The world of science needs more women, but from a young age, we girls are encouraged to care more about the way we look than about the power of our minds. <laughs> That's true. Every one of you has the capacity to be anything you want to be. Unless you want to be Cinderella. <laughs> Come at me, see what happens. Did you know last weekend Priya took Leonard rollerblading at the beach? Can you believe that? I feel like I'm supposed to say that bitch, but I don't have enough information. <laughs> two years trying to get him to even go to the beach in the first place. He was so phobic about stepping on medical waste, I had to carry him to the water. I took Howard to the beach once. He almost burst into flames like a vampire. So what's the thanks I get for turning Leonard into quality boyfriend material? I have to tiptoe around his new girlfriend. I think you're on. Oh, that bitch! You guys are getting along? Yeah, I guess. We're very different people, Howard, so communication's a little tricky. Does he like the pancakes? He didn't try them yet! Is there any butter? It's butter-flavored syrup. So, what's the word? He wants butter! <laughs> it's butter-flavored syrup! I just told him that! I don't need any butter. If you want butter, I'll get you butter. Howard and Bernadette, the five of us stand before you as your friends and newly ordained ministers. Louder! <laughs> they all got ordained! They're all marrying us! It's adorable! If you want to hear, come closer! All right, my turn. <clears throat> Howard, Bernadette, Dach Daj Mok. Shelton, I told you don't cling on. Fine, I'll do it in English, but it loses something. Howard, help me out of that sub. I'm stuck again. <laughs> okay, Shelton. What happens to our neuroreceptors when we don't get enough REM sleep? They lose their sensitivity to serotonin and norepinephrine. Which leads to... Impaired cognitive function. Right. So march in there, brush your teeth, and go to bed. But I don't want to go to bed. I'm going to count to three. One. Oh, all right. <laughs> Not if you're doing it for a long time. <laughs> no, let's take Sheldon dancing. Oh, I totally want to see Sheldon dance. I bet he looks like a spider on a hot plate. <laughs> no, thank you, but... How do I look? Fine. Uh-oh, is someone a little blue? <laughs> Tell you the truth, I'm not really in the mood. What are you talking about? It'll be fun. All your friends will be there. Yeah, it's some friends, they all think I'm boring. Maybe you should go without me. No, if I'm there alone, people might think I'm just a really short person from Avatar. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just don't want to go. Hey, I just spent the last three hours coloring myself blue. I'm going to be washing paint out of my smart for a month. Fine. 
Two weeks ago, I was an astronaut. Yeah, well, now you're a Smurf. Keep walking. <laughs> Whoa, drinky Smurf. <laughs> Can I talk to you for a second? Right now, I'm in trouble. <laughs> you heard me? You, out! You are being very rude. No, I'm not. They're all being rude, and you're being rude. Me? What did I do? Oh, how we... <laughs> Stop talking about space so much. Nobody likes it. I don't sound like that. You're my wife. You're supposed to be on my side. I'm always on your side. Then why are you trying to take this away from me? Being an astronaut is the coolest thing I'm ever gonna do. And if I stop talking about it, then I'm just... Just what? Just plain old Howard Wallowitz again. Plain old Howard Wallowitz is the best guy I know. You're just saying that. No, I'm not. I married him. On purpose. Come <laughs> here. I love you. I love you, too. Where'd she go? I don't know. She didn't leave a note. What? You were the one who was supposed to put her back in the stroller. No, I wasn't. You were. No, I wasn't. Yes, you were. Yeah, well, you throw like a girl. And you, when you let me down, the poor thing's been shaking for hours. I'm really sorry. Hang on, you've had her for hours? Yes. I picked her up, and then we both went for massages to try and calm down, and then we got pink berry. So you knew she was okay, and you couldn't pick up the phone to tell us? Well, I, I, I thought about... Do well me, mister. We've been worried sick. She could have been dead for all we knew. You should be ashamed of yourself. Sorry, I, I just... Sorry's not good enough. Maybe you need to take some time and think about what you've done. <laughs> Nice guilt trip. <laughs> you are gonna be an amazing mom. <laughs> you jerk face! What did you tell Howard? Did you say there was something going on between us? Because he thinks there is! He's completely freaking out! Please, come in. so nice to me. I thought maybe you liked me. I'm nice to everyone! I'm sorry. Damn right you're sorry. And you tell Howard there's never been anything between us. I will. Hey, Bernadette? What? Do you think I have a shot with Penny? Of course you do! You're a cutie pie! Any girl would be lucky to have you! Gosh, Amy, I'm sensing a little hostility. Is it maybe because, like Sheldon's work, your sex life is also theoretical? <laughs> Damn. Well, at least when we do make love, Sheldon won't be thinking about his mother. <laughs> and yes, that is a cleverly veiled reference to Howard's lifelong obsession to crawl back into her spacious womb. <laughs> see a box of crayons without crossing my legs. <laughs> I don't have to take this. I'm gonna go home and have sex with my husband right now. Maybe I'll let him do it to me in a parking spot. <laughs> Which sounds dirty, but I didn't mean it that way. Well, that doesn't make sense either. Why not? Because I'm the one who had it towed. <laughs> you? Didn't see that one coming, did you? Oh, yeah? Well, you're not gonna see this coming. Oh! Oh, what the hell do you have in there? With just my wallet, keys, and a coffee can full of change, have a meaning to take to the bank. Don't move, I'll get some ice. Oh, are you okay? Get away from here, I swear to God, I will rip out what's left of your pills. Sorry. You hit her. What did I do? You had my car towed. You were parked in Howard's spot. I was parked in Sheldon's spot. Sheldon doesn't have a spot. Guys, I think.
think I need to go to the emergency room. Oh. Okay, let's go. Oh, I'll drive. You oh. can see where the tow truck scratched my car. The tow truck didn't scratch your car. How do you know? Because I did it. <laughs> oh, our guest. We can't just ask him to straighten our closet. No, we wouldn't ask him. We'd just show him the closet and let the goblins in his head take it from there. <laughs> Sheldon, I know tonight's the night you ate Thai food, so I went to the Asian market, got all the ingredients, and made it from scratch. Oh, you shouldn't have. Oh, it's my pleasure. No, you really shouldn't have. <laughs> I brought my own. Stopped and got him takeout? I had no choice. He kept kicking the back of my seat. Sheldon, I've been cooking all day. Well, now don't you feel silly. <laughs> Show him the closet. <laughs> Did you hear? Isn't it terrible? Have you seen him? He wouldn't let me in. Oh, my Howie! It'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. It'll be okay. <laughs> it's Howard. <clears throat> Howard, hello. Raj, is that you? Yeah, I'm right here, buddy. How are you? Listen to me. I'm not going to make it. No, 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 don't say that. You're, you're going to be all right. Raj, I don't have time. Now, pay attention. Uh, my last wish is that you look after Bernadette. Of course, of course. Now, when you say look after, you mean... Sexually. Excuse me, Bernadette. I have to hear it from him. Sexually. Got it. Take care. I guess I have no choice but to make sweet, guilty love to you over and over again for the rest of my life. That's how I heard it. <laughs> like the wild elephant, I am trumpeting my love for you. Like a hidden flower, my sweet fragrance comes into view. Like the sun at noon. My desert welcomes you like the rain monsoon. You are my heart. My universe. You are my heart. My universe. My universe. You are my heart. My universe. You are my heart. My universe. You are my heart. My universe. Drill, I'll be fine. <laughs> so, did you miss me? Oh. Are you kidding? Every minute of every. Excuse me. Sweetie, we don't have to do this now. <laughs> yes, we do. <laughs> after we got married. <laughs> this is like our honeymoon. <laughs> now, hold on to your hat. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Oh. You okay? Oh, Dizzy. <laughs> Must be the Benadryl. <laughs> Switch places with me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> me. Bernadette? Bernie? Bernie? <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> you made me feel things I know. That was quick and a little gross. <laughs> now I know.
know how she feels. 